And Miracle. Yeah, Miracle is the little... Counter. <laughs> Quest road, boys. Let's go. Quest road is back. Is back on the ladder. Ah, that's actually very big. Cause I can't really pressure much now. I don't know if double tire is worth it, man. Like, I kind of like it, but in some matchups, you kind of want to pressure a little bit, too. Where did the hunters go, guys? I want to farm these hunters. So, what is the meta now? People are going very greedy. Like, I'm playing a deck to beat the aggro more. But people have been going very greedy on ladder now. I want to pressure a bit. Tar doesn't pressure. Oh, draws double engineer. Ow. Normally I would ram, but this hand is very bad, so I think I'm gonna draw. Don't use your removal here. Let's run one tire. Yeah, but it makes the Oak Art kind of weaker too. Plus it can also make your Oak on summons a little more inconsistent. I feel, still think it's then consistent enough, but there are fire backs of it too. Quest Rogue, guys! New Quest Rogue beatable? No, Quest Rogue is still a very strong deck. But we have better shots now because cards like Tw the Drake are very nice. Wait. Oh, he got it from Mimic Pod even. Um, so he has how far? 3 5. He has an Engineer for 2 mana. I think I should play the minion here. Like spells can always be good. Minions just become so much worse. Did I play Quest Priest? I'm not gonna play that now. It has been very poor for me lately. And uh, we are getting towards the end of the season. We are at like the 28th of May. So I kind of want to see if I can get myself into the top ranks. To qualify myself again for the European Regionals. Yeah, play it greedy guys. Play it greedy with minions. Actually it does very decent. Because I feel they are committing a bit more now, these rogues. Easy, Drake. Taz, why wasn't rank 4 good enough? Nah, I'm kinda wanna settle my top 25, maybe, but... Uh, I don't think 4 ever holds uh, 5 days before. Don't overdraw head on Ox. That's a very early finish, guys. Let's punish this. Let's just punish this. That's so bad. What? Oh! <laughs> oh, that hurts. Oh, that hurts. No. Oh. I think it's fine. Hedronox. We need to save Naturalize for Hedronox. One finishes out. Would love to save my branching caps if I can. Hey guys, I think Lich King is good with this deck. Why don't you try putting it in the deck? Uh, Lich King is in the deck. He is in the deck. Um, Lich King is definitely good in the more greedier matchups. That's where you want him. It's just nice to kill off your own things. Because don't underestimate guys that my Hedronox is not good yet. Because he saps me. My minions don't, didn't die. Good draw. Friends, 
probably have to do it here so he doesn't sap it. Uh, let me think. Yeah, we do it here. Ooh! Bye bye, Seppy! Baby, just sap yourself out of the game. <laughs> Second finish! Let's go! We get the Q back, so that's good. But he already played one finish, where I said, ooh, that might cost you the game. But I don't think he realized it yet, guys. That finishing like that can also have paybacks. And well, look at this board. How are you gonna? F how are your four fours doing into this board? Um, not so great. He can go Sonya with deckhand or something, That's being slightly annoying. We just have to keep the branching paths. Don't touch the branching paths. This card can become very good, very good. Hmm. Time is ticking. Don't panic. Don't panic. Only five seconds. Panic. 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 Sick turn. Help. <laughs> what is this turn? Oh no, you get it back to the head. Help. 9, 12. 9, 12. 16. 16 plus 8 is 24, 28, 29. No lethal. Am I over as extending into lifesteal there? Right. If I pick attack, guys, you can only life steal for four. Because a minion dies. Well, I can life steal for eight, I guess, but then he doesn't get anywhere. He needs to finish, right? That's another one. That's not the one he bounced back. So he has both in the hand. I'm not sure if this play was correct. Because it's kind of like the card you want to finish the game with. But Witching Hour is just useless here. Like, you don't Witching Hour because he just finishes it anyway, I feel. Like, this doesn't get anywhere, guys. He's not able to just minion trade everything, right? There's the second finish. But the good thing is we get the Q well back. Met. And that's why we're gonna win. Because of the Q. How do Q. you not rage quit when you lose to RNG and Twitch chat is using red face? I always quit after first loss. Tell me how to keep my cool. Well. You get used to it, man. Helps a lot when you play Hearthstone for 7-8 hours a day. Some things, sometimes things go your way. Sometimes things don't go your way. That's why you kill off your own minions, guys. Like, in this game, I cube my own Drake, I cube my own Tar Creeper. Imagine if I did not do that. Imagine if I would have not done that, guys. I would have nothing. So you Tar, you, you really cube your own stuff. Um, But, I mean, that's also the game that I played. Um... I do my best to win as much as I can and the win the if you look at the ever or at the win rate that we have with the deck I'm uh, very happy because I play also against very good opponents and Hearthstone is a game where you don't win every game you try to win as much as you can over time like the you can show you being a better player not in every game but you can show it in like if you look at uh, look at it from the long term perspective. So don't look o like don't look over one game. Don't look over ten games. Look over for me. I don't even look over one hundred games. I start to look at things over like maybe a thousand games. Eight plus eight uh, plus one. How much is that? That's seventeen. How do I kill my own Hadronox? I don't. Well, I also don't need to. 
I mean, do a bit more your best, bro. Just chill. We can just chill here. Yeah, we win this game. And that's what I mean, guys. This matchup is not as bad as you think uh, anymore. And Quest Rogue's just... Like, it's it's very cool when people, like, queue into you with Quest Rogue. But they also need to know how to play the matchup. And I feel a lot of people have no idea how. Like, what, why do you even play double Sonya, for example? Why not just one Sonya? And then do it next turn again. Like, I feel Quest Rogues just have no idea how to play Quest Rogue that well. It's a very difficult deck too. This matchup is very complicated. And I think he threw a big part of it already by the first finish. Okay, so he has unlimited boars now. So he has unlimited boars. So what I have to do is maybe not play into that. I don't want to play minions with uh, 4 attack, that's my plan here. Just don't want to have minions with 4 attack, because then he can like unlimited go boar, bomb, 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 bomb. 69 boys. I feel every day I'm taking rank 69 now at least like 3 times a day. 